Hello. Hello. We're about to bust a Nick Cage nut all over everybody. <laughs> I, I guess you could say that. <laughs> all over this loose butthole. Come on, let's go. Uh, yes, it's uh, the Willy's loose Wonderland. butthole review of Willy's Wonderland. That's not a that's not a porn parody. That's that's just the title. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's it's just the title. So uh, that is one that you could just you could just keep it the same name. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> works as one, but you know, we don't. I think we should have waited for those jokes for the minute mark. <laughs> <coughs> so. <coughs> So I remember how it begins. Uh, I remember it begins kind of like I don't know. It didn't. It didn't have a very strong beginning. The horror part in the beginning, like when it's just like that family getting like attacked. I get. I, I get that they're saving like showing the guys, like showing the, um, the animatronics. But there's it, it's actually kind of a reoccurring problem uh, that I'm going to mention later of why I, of why I have a. Why I have my star? Why? Why my? Why my uh, rating is what it is? Oh but, well, uh, I was about to, first part's kind of forgettable. I was about to say we, we, we should probably get some more structure in these reviews because we should start was, off yeah, with a keeping, rating. Was, oh, okay. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. I, was, I was keeping a structure. I was just like saying the first scene. Uh, well, I, I being forgettable. I, I was trying. I, I was gonna say let let's get our ratings out so we can get into spoilers and stuff. Oh, okay, I'll I'll, I'll, I'll let you go, you go first. All right, I well, this is a subjective rating to be honest. Yeah, yeah. But I think it's a perfect five out of five for the film that it is because it's not really a horror film. It's more of a thriller action film to me. True, true. I mean, and it's like a dark comedy too. Yeah, I guess you could see it as a dark comedy as well. Mm. And uh, I mean, I I don't I wouldn't disagree with that point, but uh, just with how I of my enjoyment with it, and I I, get, I, I think I said uh, yeah, it was gonna be uh, three and a half. Yeah, three and you half said stars out of five. Yeah, you said three. Uh, maybe point. maybe maybe leading a little bit towards. Form, but still not. It's not worthy of a four for me. It kind of. I mean, it's kind of like fun, done and quick. I don't know if I'd really like watch it again, like anytime soon. Definitely. Oh, I. Um, I would probably only watch it again if like I was watching it with a friend. But it's definitely yeah, exactly. a Nicolas Cage exactly. film that I, I. It's definitely a Nicolas Cage film that I recommend people watch. Like it's yeah, definitely it's definitely worth it's definitely worth one watch. That's why I, that's why I'm so like overall like I, I'd say a three and a half star still positive, you know. Like they 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 didn't do. I know that the, the expedition dump was poorly done and everything. And if it was me, I would have started the movie out with the expedition dump, just get the backstory out the way, and then we can just have mm. Nicolas Cage, it's, you know, it's, killing uh, people, you know. It's, it's, Nick, it's it's the ma it's macaroni of Nicolas Cage movies. It's it's a nice side to have, but I, I don't really want it as a main course. Yeah, I I completely uh, I can, I guess I could understand, but I'm sticking with my <laughs> five point five because they 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 were it, it was short enough. It was short enough. There wasn't a time in the movie where I was like looking at the clock, going, "All right, can can we uh, speed things up or?" Or something, the, you know. They 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 were able to pace out the dull moments enough anything. within the fight scenes with Nicolas Cage and everything. And any time that Nicolas Cage is on the the screen, he he's just hamming it up. I mean, it's just it's just just pure ham from him the whole movie. Also, also though, like if Nicolas Cage wasn't there, this wouldn't be a like film a then. <laughs> This would yeah, not be a film. If it was just those like those kid characters and maybe like just like some some other generic person, it would suck. Right? Oh no 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 no! Nick, Nick Cage is definitely the reason why this is such a a perfect film for me. It, it's it's just one of the films that like he is just 
because he it's him, he he makes it perfect for me. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah, that's I, I agree with that. But I, I feel like I don't know, I feel like the animatronics could have had stronger kills. I mean Nicolas Cage's kills are all fucking perfect and great, but like I don't know, like there's the uh, team well, kills are pretty like fucking I guess like, if you're lame. going into the film for looking for more of a animatronics versus uh humans. I mean they, but I, they, I, I mean, was going in anyway, solely but... for the thought of Nick Cage kicking ass. <laughs> Yeah, and then you have Nicolas Cage kicking ass, but you could have the animatronics, like, you know, tearing up the, the, the teens a little bit more, like, gruesomely. Like, the uh, only thing I, we really got was when that cop got, like, chopped in half. And that I, was, well, I, that, and that was even <laughs> cheaply done. That was really cheaply done. And there's a lot of, but there's a lot of I, weird, I, like, I, I have CGI a feeling that that, that, that would have taken away from... A lot of weird CGI. That, that, that would have took, if they were focused on giving the animatronics awesome kills that then that would took away from the fight scenes. I think I would have added to it. it, would, it, would, it would I, just I, like, I don't know. because I, like how, I, how actually dangerous these animatronics are. Well, that's the thing, though. Like, like, I, I like... When Nicolas Cage comes, he just see, like destroys see, them. You, you, want it, the, you want Nicolas Cage to have a little more danger, which I, I think it's perfect. Like... He he's a complete badass. Like there there is no danger for him. He he knows what he's getting into. Yeah, you keep it. You keep it for some keep reason. Like that, but you, but for the uh, the teen characters add nothing other than to be just slaughter for the animatronics. So like, I don't think they, they deserved slaughtered. proper death. I, I I think they deserved off screen deaths. To be honest, the, the, I actually have the the biggest issue was the the off screen deaths. I want I wanted to see. Like oh, so up to. I I I get your disappointment there. I I can completely yeah, understand you know, your disappointment it's, it's, there. It's not it's not expensive to do like it's real. It's not expensive to do like some cheap like gore effects. Just like have them ripping out some intestines or something. You know, that, earn that rate rated R. Yeah, you know uh, I, mean? I will. I will say mm. that the alligator animatronic eating those t the the horny teenagers were was complete horseshit. That scene was terrible. Yeah, they should have been in pieces. They like that. Been in that pieces. was that. Like, oh, dude. When it comes to the alligator animatronics, like, to be honest, Side one of them should have like, been like halfway in his mouth, mm -hmm. and it should have just been like munching down on the rest. Sci-fi or sci-fi original movies do better gore. That's what I'm saying. Uh, but like that's, you know, what I mean? again, I, you, I think you, you just went into this film expecting something different than me. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I'm I was I, expecting a action film, and you you clearly was expecting more of a horror oriented. Yeah, I, I wanted to balance. I mean, I, I liked all the Nicolas Cage parts. And you just you could have them just have that unchanged. Uh, may, like... Maybe because I went in knowing my with extremely low expect, knowing that it, it was surely because Nicolas Cage was in it. Mm -hmm. Like I, I kind of knew a lot more about the film going into it than you did. You, you went in completely blind. I, I did. I, I knew about yeah. it because I, I'm the one that entered. I like when it first came out. I was like, ooh, we definitely need to watch this one. Because mm -hmm. the, the, the whole like thought of a movie that blows its budget just to have one actor in it, but can't afford to give him any lines. It's just amazing to know that that exists let me, see, um, let me let me think of like an example of like a movie i would give like a four star um oh uh, well it it's going to be in comparison you know what i mean uh well the the how why not just compare it to the movie that you're gonna the next movie we're gonna review after this Mandy. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I, yeah, I guess, I guess so. Yeah, Mandy, Mandy, of course. Yeah. Which I definitely, I feel like lo I, I loved a little bit more than you did. <laughs> I. That is true. We will get into that. We will get into why, in the in the Mandy review. Mm -hmm. But and I, I, yeah, in the Mandy review, we'll get to that. 
also get to a, a, a little film theory I have. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah. I kind of had a little but theory anyway, uh, trying to connect this to Willy's Wonderland, but I, I just... Eh. I think you could. Yeah, yeah I think you can. Like this cause like, He's called the janitor and everything. And you yeah, could say never, the reason yeah, why he's so... In, yeah. The reason why he's so silent he's like and like he that. doesn't really give a fuck is because he's like seen worse and been through worse. And he's probably perpetually tripping. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. That, that, that's another thing. But it, the the main character mm -hmm. of Willy's Wonderland doesn't seem like he's he seems to like know exactly. And that's another thing. Like he seems to know like. He seemed to, like, be aware of what was going on before it even happened. Or, I guess he just didn't care. Well, and Mandy, I mean, he's, like, aware of his surroundings, too. He just kind of sees it through a different view. Yeah, because, well, they, they, they do that. Is it him? No, no, the, it, 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 okay, okay, we, we need, we need to stop talking about Mandy, because I'm, I'm about to get into Mandy. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. Alright, alright, right, so... Uh, I guess that <laughs> that is the loose butthole review of Willy Wonderland. Even though I oh, okay. that, rated a perfect five it? out of five, I I want to talk about another film. Are we skipping right to Mandy? <laughs> I mean, we we've. I do you really want to go anymore? We we've been ten minutes. What what else can we talk about? Willy's Wonderland had a group. And the soundtrack was not very rememberable, but it didn't really take away from the film. Like, it didn't distract you. Uh, definitely worth definitely worth a watch. It's yeah, I, watch. I say definitely worth a watch. Mm. The, the, I'm still sticking to my 5 out of 5. It is a perfect Nicholas for For a Nicolas Cage film, it is a perfect film. There's better Nicolas Cage films. Well, yeah, That's what but I'm gonna say. for a Nicolas Cage to film. Watch. Okay, yeah. So three, three point right. five. <laughs> so that will be a uh, bye bye. Bye bye.